Welcome back to Let's Play Wonder Boy, the Dragon's Trap, Burning Dog fans. We're here deep underwater at the beach, and I have absolutely no idea what I'm meant to be doing. This is not a design flaw, it's just the way games were back in the day. I never had a Sega Master System, but I do remember a lot of really confusing games on the NES. Confession, until this year, I thought the, uh... Whenever I heard the name Sega Master System, my brain sort of lumped it in with the Sega Mega Drive, which is what they called the Sega Genesis in, uh, Europe. Ah, oh, come on! Are you kidding me? That's a garish background. I didn't even notice that before, as focused as I was on the, uh... On the, uh... The fucking seashells here. Clams! That's the word. Ah. Uh, jumped right into that. Oh, it's money. Ow. Since that guy giving hints just gives passwords in the original version. I wouldn't mind if they wanted to have him be more direct than gamers were in the 80s, you know? Hey, maybe you should go to the beach and look for, you know, whatever item. Now, the underwater sections might be strange to you guys, but uh, keep in mind, according to Dungeons & Dragons, lizard folk can hold their breath for 15 minutes at a stretch. I hate you so much, it's unreal. Wait a minute. No, no, it was mad before, not may. So, I've done something. Are there any other pages of this? No. <sighs> Shit. Okay, um... I guess I could try to go back. Never done anything like this before, as I've mentioned. Well, that shouldn't have worked, but okay, I'll allow it. Because it was in my favor, of course. So video games work. Oh, it was one of you bastards that got me killed last time. I remember now. Uh -huh.
That was dumb of you. Where'd it go, reflexes? Ah! Thank you. probably go down those wells on the other side, by the way. I am aware of, you know, that's probably a thing. It looked much meaner back in the day. Sucks. Fucking... Thank you, Arrow, for helping me resolve that idiotic scenario. I wonder what's up with that door there, since I don't... Oh, I see. Yeah, that'll get me back up there. Sorry, Pac-Man. Didn't recognize you. These guys are just going to walk into me. Yeah, okay, fine. Always a pleasure. Please get hurt and come back soon. Oh, I see, yeah. Uh, they, there became a thing in uh, gaming where... The Red Cross started raising a stink about uh, the use of their uh, logo. They claimed that uh, using it in video games 
diluted people's awareness of the Red Cross as a symbol that means this is where you get medical attention, wherever you are in the world. And me, I thought it would have enhanced it, but hey, it's their legal bills. So now when you go to the present, he's got a hat with a uh, syringe on it instead. Uh, the other place I've seen that effect has been, uh, what was it, the versions of Doom... Yeah, the versions of the original Doom and Doom 2 that came with, uh... Doom 3 BFG Edition, where, uh, the Red Cross and the health kits had been swapped out for, uh, I believe a, uh, capsule pill. Ah, delicious. I like the crab on the patient table, by the way. Alright, fine. No, he just walks into me. I'll take that. Oh, and I have to use it immediately. No equivalent to that. They just added a uh, thing they can do. Interesting. As soon as I get in range, they do that. made a part of me was worried about the age of this game. When I was a kid, I didn't really like NES games. I thought I didn't like video games for the longest time. And part of that is that a lot of NES games were really, really hard, because the developers were still coming in off of the arcade game mindset, which is make it really hard so that they have to spend more quarters in order to beat the game. But, uh... My, you know, child mind didn't understand that, uh, you know, some games were made intentionally really hard, and some games, in fact, were just really badly made. I actually remember at one point we rented, from, like, fucking Blockbuster Video, the, uh, the NES game based on Home Alone, which is, uh, infamously terrible. But, uh, yeah, at the time, I had no idea that there even could be such a thing as a bad game. I thought they were all made to the same, you know, level of quality, uh, and testing and such as, you know, first-party Nintendo games. So whenever I couldn't do well at a game, the only possible explanation is that I just suck. Just silly. Huh. How much health I get from those hearts seems to be wildly inconsistent. Okay, just checking. I hadn't actually tried that before. I just had a hunch. Because they're like horrible stone heads. Suck it, flame fish!
Look like the ghost of Lolo. Speaking of extremely dated references. <laughs> what? Oh, oh. Ah, shit! Yeah, it's a bit more obvious than this one, isn't it? I'm gonna stand just here and get a screen grab. Wish you were here. Mummy dragon. Oh god, it's a boss fight! Oh, and I'm not... Nowhere near as hell as tanky this time. I guess I have to hit him in the face. Ah. Ah, this sucks. Or I do. Ah! Oh, okay, yeah, that sounds good. Let's do that. No! No! Ah! Come on, come on! Oh, hell. Blarg, I am slain. Sorry, Wonder Boy, you be dead. Maybe I got a blue potion if it ends in a red one, is that what that is? get a blue potion, at least. Is that where the timer is going to go? That would be a really convenient time for the episode to end. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, when I lost all my... Mm. What if this is, like, just the ones for the lizard man, or what? Okay. It's part of the reason I, uh, wasn't such a huge fan of, uh, games back then. I wouldn't have been, I wouldn't be surprised to learn the original 1989 version when you died you just had to put the password in manually in order to resume your progress. Consistent how much health every given enemy has. It's a 
Sometimes the green ones take more hits, sometimes the uh, red ones take more hits, and I get that they're probably not the same between species, like the green... Oh, the green crabs here, for example, seem to be universally tough. Shit, thank you. You have my infinite thanks, oh generous chest. This is the second time I've entered a video here, and it's only been three videos, so let's mix it up a little. As much as I can. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Wonder Boy, the Dragon's Trap, when we get back in there, and we show that mummy dragon what for. Don't worry, I'll just pick up outside the boss room. Later!